Hello, my name is Emmanuel Diaz, and I am in your fourth period. And here's my CB essay. In the story CB, there is a king, a hawk, and a dove. The hawk hunting the dove, the dove flies to the king for asylum. After arguing, as the king tries to throw the hawk off the dove topic, it goes right back. The dove asked for the king's flesh. I mean, the hawk asked for the king's flesh in the weight of the dove. But the king doesn't know that the dove was cursed to weigh the same as the king. The king then cuts off chunks of his legs, but it doesn't change the skill which the dove is on. The king then sacrifices himself in righteousness. During that, the dove and the hawk turn into gods, which, which tell the god, gods, which, that, which tell the king that it was all a test. Hold on, I'm sorry, I got lost. Oh, and everything went back to normal. The author's purpose for writing the story is to entertain and teach a moral or a lesson. In the story CB, there is no information that is given, whether factual or biased. The story does not persuade me one to an opinion or other sides or any other sides. This story entertains the reader by bringing imagination and the basics of a story. It has a situation and a resolution, which is one of many story bases. This story is important because it gives the reader insight to how people felt about things. Also, how gods from Indians' um, polytheistic religion behave or were alike. Such as testing people in the story like they did with the king to teach their religious morals and show the materialism of gods so we can see or perceive them this, re this relates to other texts I have read such as such as the Bible or Torah in the story CB it has a history and a lesson or moral which can be seen all throughout the Torah Old Testament and the Bible New Testament in these scriptures, many of the historical teachings or stories deal with moral and ethics, such as in the story, the king um, showed compassion and sacrifice. This document relates to visuals and artifacts such as Mahabharata talking book, the visuals of kings, uh, of king's jewelry and how they looked helps the reader portray the character in their imagination. What is significant in the story's history is that it comes from world, the world's longest epic poem. It also tells us about how the gods are portrayed and expected morals. Many of these poems or stories are also the history of, Hin of the Hindu religion, which may not be accurate as they think as one sees in the story CB. That is my poem. I mean, my essay.